an Indian diplomat accused of visa fraud and lying about how much she paid her housekeeper in the United States is to escape prosecution after being given diplomatic immunity. Federal prosecutors announced an indictment against Devyani Kobragard on Thursday, which accuses her of fraudulently obtaining a work visa for her housekeeper by exaggerating how much she paid her. However, a letter to judges from prosecutors said they understood Cobra Guard had been given full diplomatic status and the case would not proceed. There will not need to be an arraignment on the indictment scheduled at this time, the letter said. We understand that the defendant was very recently accorded diplomatic immunity status. Cobra Guard was detained in New York on December 12 and accused of falsely declaring on a visa application the earnings of St. Gita Richard, her Indian nanny. After her arrest, Cobra Guard, who was then the Deputy Consul General at the Indian Consulate in New York, was transferred to the UN mission in New York as a diplomat, a transfer that afforded her diplomatic immunity. The U.S. State Department is given the option to refuse such transfers. However Al Jazeera's Rosaland Jordan, reporting from Washington, D.C., quoted a U.S. government official as saying that it would have been unprecedented to do so. The U.S. requested a waiver of immunity in order for Cobra Guard's case to go forward, but India denied it, the official told Al Jazeera. We have requested her departure, and the charges remain in place. Documents filed in a Manhattan court show Cobra Guard declared paying her nanny $4,500 a month, when in fact she received only $500 a month about $3.31 per hour and far less than the $9.75 minimum wage in the state of New York. Cobra Guard is believed to still be in the U.S. Prosecutors said the charges would remain on file.